Good day to my lecturer. Today, I, Toyushet, and I, Muhammad Farhan bin Hisham, are going to present our math assignment 3. The question that we get is, verify whether the function gx equal to x squared minus 4 is one-to-one -one function by using algebraic method and horizontal line test. In order to identify whether a function is one-to-one -one function or not, we can use two methods. Let us start with the first method, algebraic method. A function is one-to-one -one function if gx1 equals to gx2 implies that x1 equals to x2. So we begin our calculation with let gx1 equals to gx2. Next, substitute the x1 and x2 into our function gx. x1 squared minus 4 equals to x2 squared minus 4. Move negative 4 to the other side and become positive 4. Rewrite the equation as x1 squared equals to x2 squared. Move the squared to the other side. Remember, in our algebraic method, when we move the squared to the other side, it will become positive negative square root. We can simplify our square root with square and get to the answer, which is x1 equals to positive x2 and x1 equals to negative x2. So from this calculation, we are able to notice that we got two answer for x1, which means we are not managed to get only x1 equal x2. x1 is not equal to x2. Therefore, we can conclude that this function is not a one-to-one -one function. method is horizontal line test. If the horizontal line intersects at only one point, this function can be said that it's one-to-one -one function. In other words, if the horizontal line intersects at two or more points, this function is not one-to-one -one function. Before we draw the horizontal line, we need to draw our our graph first. Domain of this function is negative infinity to infinity while the range is negative 4 to infinity from the equation we can see that our x is equal to 0 and y is equal to negative 4 therefore our minimum point is equal to 0 negative 4 now we can start to draw our graph. Y axis, X axis, and remember our zero. The shape of this function is parabola. We can see that the graph intersect X axis at two points. So we need to find out the value of X. As we know, at X axis, Y is equal to zero. square minus 4 equal to 0. Move the negative 4 to the other side and become positive 4. Move the square and we manage to get positive negative 2. Negative 2, positive 2. Now, we can draw out our horizontal line. And don't forget to label it. that the horizontal line intersect two points with the graph. Since horizontal line intersects at two points. Therefore, we can conclude that gx is not n. One to one function. That's all about our presentation and thanks for watching.